Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Guys, for today's video, I'm going to teach you how to calculate the anchor turning circle. So, let's start. One shackle. One shackle is equivalent to 27.5 meters. Okay? One nautical miles is equivalent to 1852 meters. And then let's say our ship length ship length this is the overall okay overall ship length overall let's say we have 300 meters then your captain is going to drop anchor six shackles into the water six shackles into the water now these are the things that we are needed in order to compute the anchor turning circle so let's go on to our formula turning circle turning circle turning circle radius in nautical mile it should be nautical mile our turning circle radius it should be nautical mile okay Number of shackle. Number of shackles times 27.5 plus our length overall or length of the ship. Length overall. Okay. Then divided by 1, 8, Five two. Got it? Again, this is our formula in order to find the anchor turning circle. Turning circle radius, it should be nautical mile, is equal to number of shackles times or multiply 27.5 plus length overall over 1852. So let's start. How many shackles we have? We have six shackles. So number of shackles. Six shackles times 27.5. 27.5 meters. Why? Because one shackle is equivalent to 27.5 meters. Okay? Then plus or add the length overall so our ship length overall is 300 meters so we have 300 meters over 1852 so next 6 times 27.5 okay we're gonna use you and I'm gonna show you how to compute that. It's only basic. 6 times 27.5 is equal to 100, 165 meters. Okay? Plus the 300 meters, the overall length. Over 18. Five two. Okay. Next, one hundred sixty-five meters plus three hundred meters is equal to four hundred sixty-five meters divided by one eight five two. Okay, 1852. So equal divided by 1852. So we have 0 0.251 nautical miles. 
so that's it guys we have 0.251 nautical miles so if you're asking why is it nautical miles because we converted the 465 meters into nautical, nautical miles we have 1852 because one nautical mile is equal to 1852 so 465 divided 1852 nautical miles yeah. so 0 0.251 nautical miles guys if you have question clarification or any suggestion for you to help you in your studying just comment to the comment section and i will reply as i am available and guys don't forget to subscribe and of course click the notification bell thank you so much and bye